Wow. League of the Falls. Outstanding. It is the Klein River off to my right. We are making our way up the Pinto Lake Trail along the Klein River. We're gonna fork off in a few kilometers and head up towards Lake of the Falls. Finally getting back out here to tag that lake that I didn't hit last time, so pretty still Some cool with views that. along the way here. I think we're gonna have a mix of sun and clouds today, so it's not gonna be a bluebird day, but she's pretty. Lady. Hi, puppy. And some more sweet views. Pretty area. Super pretty here. Awesome shit, man. So we drop down to this little canyon here, across this creek, and continue on up this way. Well, we are here at uh, Entry Creek. Uh, this is the spot that uh, Craig and I camped at when we did our hike from Pinto up to Landslide. Uh, just had a good lunch here, and now we're gonna continue on our way. It's uh, It's been pretty cool today. We really have not made a whole lot of miles because we uh, decided to do some bushwhacking. It was fun. But yeah, should be a decent afternoon. Weather's looking pretty. Should be all right. Oh, skirt through the trees a bit and then come to a nice little opening. Another one of the random camps that gets set up along the way here all the time. And be a pretty slick spot to camp though. Awesome views here. Yeah, somebody took some time into this one. Super pretty here. Lady. Think I'm fun. Think I'm fun. Oh, this is all new. Over the bridge to Lake of the Falls. Ugh. Apparently we got some pretty good climbing from here, so. That's cool. Super pretty here. Lots of climbing, but lots of switchbacks, but super pretty. That waterfall is pretty sick. Just for you, Lens. We got a wildlife sighting. We got some sheep. So the big one is stable, the little one wobbles, but it's not gonna move. So just, one, just go to the little one. Just step firmly on it. It's not going to move. Aim far though. There you go. <laughs> oh man, this is pretty here. Really pretty here. Oh, Lake of the Falls is a pretty good slog, but holy crap. This is outstanding. It's phenomenal here.
This is gorgeous, boys. This is wicked. Well, I'm gonna give props to everybody who does these shots because it fucking sucks coming back to get the camera every time. All right, sure. Netto. This is for you because I know you're gonna fucking love this shit. Look at this. This is the trail we're walking on here, following this fucking creek, and look at this shit. Like, I'm fucking real here. This is awesome. Wow. Oh. Lake of the Falls. Outstanding. Absolutely sick views here. Oh, what do you guys think? <sighs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> That's pretty, man. Well, camp is set up. So, obviously, this is me here in the hammock, and this is Isaac and Simon in the three person MSR. And then Buddy with his cool little lunch and two in the back here. A little hundred dollar Chinese tent. Looks pretty sick. Works like a charm. Looks pretty sick. And of course, I got the entertainment set up. <laughs> so that's how we're gonna watch movies tonight. It's gonna be fucking bombs. And this is gonna be our view. Kicking over the hammock. You guys up for a midnight hike? Fuck yeah. Dude, I'm up for it. This is sick. This is what I'm gonna be looking at first thing tomorrow morning. Unreal. Oh, just stellar here. Oh, just taking a walk to go find a spot to hang some food. But yeah, this place is outstanding. So our camp is literally just back and around the corner here. That's where we're camped at. I'm not taking that picture, there's no way. Yeah, you are. That's a really hot look. What? Yep, that's pretty sweet. Dinos and SoCo. Oh, it is, uh, it's 20 after 10 here, and yeah, we're all curled up in the bed. I am max and relaxing in the hammock, insanely comfortable, insanely warm. Oh, you can see it in my eyes, I'm gonna be out soon. It's gonna be good sleep. I think we're gonna try and get up early, have an early breakfast, load up some water, uh, I think we're just gonna have one pack, like one guy's just gonna carry water. It's not gonna be that much weight, I'll probably do it. And we're gonna go and do the Lake of the Falls lookout, which is supposed to be pretty sweet. So we're hoping it's sunny skies and we're gonna get some awesome views. But anyways, they're off to bed. Good night. Beautiful morning out. A really, really sick view. Check this out. Good morning from the hammock. This is a 
easily the best morning view I've ever had from the hammock so far. This is pretty bomb. So. Porch mode for the win. Chilly morning. Breakfast going. Got an instant coffee and some uh, energy gummies for the morning hike. Trail snacks for the morning and some oatmeal for breakfast. And got water going. It's gonna be good. This will be the breakfast view. It's sick here. Really sick here. Hear him, but I can't see him. There's been a chopper buzzing around here. They do a lot of like helicopter tours at this lake. So he like came flying in over this way, like super low, but I was way too slow and I couldn't get my camera out in time. And now I think he just went up and over that range. Probably going down towards Pinto Lake, but oh, just absolutely amazing here. This is wicked to wake up to. Oh, are you getting your breakfast, lady? Are you getting your breakfast? Breakfast time. <sighs> Assuming we may get some waterfall views coming up here. This is pretty rad. Oh man. Wicked. Yeah, this is sweet. So this is, uh, this post here designates this little flat spot here. This is where the helicopters will come land. This is a pretty popular destination for people to do like fly-in trips. I do like fly in, go fish the lake. It's supposed to be lots of good trout there. Just wicked though. Right now we're just having some fun. Here we go, a little scrambling. Oh wow. That is cool. This is sweet. Standalone outcropping of trees there. That's where our camp is. The far end of the lake there. Just wicked up here though. It would not be a far drop down that way. Wow. This is awesome. So earlier when I took the video, I was up, we were up on these cliffs up here, on these ledges. That was pretty rad. We went out to about here. Got a good look at the lake and then we're gonna head back, get packed up, get some lunch, and head off to landslide for the day. Should be pretty awesome. Hey bear! 
it's always a good sign when you don't see a head pop up. Oh, just, uh, this may look familiar, making our way down from Lake of the Falls. The hike out is definitely a lot easier. It's a lot of climbing on the hike in. It's all downhill on the hike out pretty much, so it's not too bad, but I gotta, I gotta say, I am thoroughly impressed with the new kicks here. So I don't know if you guys have seen on my Instagram or not, but I'm rocking these new, uh, they're the Solomon Speedcross 4s. I decided to make the switch to trail runners. Uh, I know they're not like the most well-known brand for uh, like uh, trail runners for hiking, but I have super narrow feet and I have an impossible time finding shoes and boots that will fit me. Um, yeah, like I tried the Ultra Lone Peaks and they're just, they're way too wide. I tried a couple pairs of Brooks and they're too wide. Um, the Asics weren't bad, so if you got narrow feet, look at Asics. But yeah, these Solomons are, they're pretty wicked so far. I've put them through pretty much every single terrain we can hit in the Rockies and they have held up. They've been awesome, man. My feet feel great. It's, uh, yeah, a great move to make if you're looking into it. But anyways, we are going to keep going down and Lady, you having fun? Are you having fun? Oh yeah, my little tail just going. The tail's just going. Pretty here though. Oh, there uh, hasn't been a ton of filming on this part here. I'm making my way up to the landslide lake right now. Uh, I've already done this section, so if you want to see clips from that, maybe take a look at my Klein River hike video, but kind of stop and catch my breath here. I've been fucking flying up this mountain. Holy hell. But sweet little waterfall here. Makes for a good stop. But let's keep going. Actually, uh, on my own right now. The other guys I'm with are a little bit behind. They wanted to, uh, head up and hit the little Hidden Lake side trail. And I was just kinda, you know what? I'll save that for another Landslide trail. Lake. Not the same shot as last time I was here, but it looks the same, cause she's pretty clouded in. But hopefully the weather report sticks and she don't rain. Now I just gotta get to the other side. Let's rock and roll. So. I am literally just skirting the edge of Landslide Lake here. There is a little faint trail. So, if you do ever come into Landslide, the first chance you get to get down to the shore of the lake, do that, it, the hiking's way easier. When you're walking up through the trees, there's a lot of sections that are really swampy and boggy. I tried to go through those. Uh, yeah, I guess just trying to, you know, test out the different terrain with my trail runners here. And I have wet feet. I know they're gonna dry out. I mean, I, I forded two rivers with them yesterday. My feet were dry pretty quick, so that's a bonus. But this is much nicer walking, much nicer. Well, we are uh, all set up here at uh, Landside Lake. And uh, in the background here, Mike and Zoe came to meet us, which is pretty sweet. We've got two dogs with us now and fire going. Pretty sick views. Should be a good night. She's gonna be chilly though. She's already getting cold and a little bit rainy and snowy, but should be all right. Sweet spot here at Landside Lake. Nice flowing creek, fresh water beside us. Can't go wrong. We'll be living the hammock life. Let the tarp pull down low though. Gonna probably expect some rain tonight, I'm assuming. Oh, hi lady. Is that where you're sleeping? Is that your spot? Right there? Okay. Right, I'm shooting this just for you, just to show you that I'm cursed here, dude. Look at this, gray skies. And it's blue. Not where I am. Oh, 10.30, she's raining. 
Yeah. Shibi soggy night. It's not too windy though, so shouldn't be too cold. I mean, it's pretty chilly, but I don't think it'll get that bad. Yeah, then just wake up in the morning, see what we're gonna do. Uh, yeah, it's really shitty. Um, Simon's knee is pretty jacked up right now, so we're gonna see how he's feeling in the morning and kind of make the call. Like if he's if he's really hurting, it's just gonna be an easier hike to just backtrack from here and hike out instead of going over the pass. So. Yeah, we'll kind of see what everybody's feeling like in the morning, but it's 10.30, it's raining, I'm pretty bagged, so let me get some sleep. Good night. I don't know if you can see all the raindrops on the camera on my hammock, but, or on my tarp here, but, yeah. It's seven, it's been raining all night. Just kind of coming down like this, not raining too hard, just kind of a light rain, but <sighs> enough that she's going to be wet. It was chilly this morning. Mm, need to find motivation to get out of this fucking hammock. Oh, not as nice a morning here at Landside Lake as last time I was here, but it's, uh, it's nicer than it was a couple hours ago. We're just about packed up here. Everybody's just kind of ripping the tents down to throw them in and we should be on the trail probably within the next 20 minutes or so. But I think we're gonna hike back out over the climb. I don't think we're gonna do the pass. It's looking pretty nasty right now. Like you can't even actually see the pass, but the parts of it you can see lots of snow up there. So like that is the pass right there sitting in the snow. So I don't think we're gonna head up there. And just with all the rain, it's pretty, it's gonna be pretty slick coming down, but I think that going down the climb should be an easier hike out. Yeah, cool little spot here at Landslide. So if you, uh, if you come out to the lake here, if you come from the Klein way, go to the back end of the lake and you'll find this awesome little, it's almost like a little peninsula of trees and cool little spot, super easy to set up. Yeah, this is a very sweet little camp spot here for sure. Oh, she is a chilly morning, but it's looking pretty stellar here. We're getting some blue skies up ahead of us, so. We've uh, just about made it to the opposite side of landslide and and we just start going down. It's pretty here though, super pretty. Yeah, this is pretty stellar here. Back at the landslide lookout, and she's still pretty socked in. We're getting patches of blue skies above us, so it's looking promising where we're headed. Sorry. Are you having fun? <laughs> well, we are back down at the bridge for the turn off. So, I think a decent time getting back. It's chilly out though. Like every time we stop, I gotta pull my hoodie out and put it on to warm up. And I'm gonna try rocking the uh, the athletic style today, going with the, the base layer and shorts. It's just, I think these will dry out faster than my pants if they get wet. I just don't feel like carrying the weight of heavy, wet pants right now. So, oh. It's been good though. It's nice and pretty here, man. Nice and pretty. Clouds are rolling in again though, so hopefully she don't rain on us. 
That would suck. We're coming down this little slope here and working our way down around the river. There's a trail down there. I know it doesn't look like it, but there's a trail. Yeah. Fucking Rockies, man. Oh, Amazing. pretty. Getting some views, finally. Pretty sweet spot. Dogs are loving it. You have fun, Zoe? There, I'll get the old syntax shot. Woo. We're finally getting down to the sections of easier trail, so should be able to pick up some some time here. I mean, we're we're making pretty good time. All things considered, but it's nice to get sections of flat, relatively easy trail. It's been mostly downhill, a lot of boulder hopping all morning, but this is not too shabby. Chill in here, having a little break. Got back to the uh, the confluence campground here, so. Right at Entry Creek. It's a cool site, like it's just massive wide open. There's a couple more spots like back in here and back over here. There's a little fire pits and there's a bear hang over in here. Yeah, super cool little spot though. Oh, some more stellar views here. This is pretty rad. Wicked here. I do believe we kind of walk this ridge here for a bit and we drop down and we got across this little canyon cream stream that's down here at some point there's a little bridge and pretty nerdy little hill we got to go down but for now we just get to roll by and enjoy this this is pretty rad been walking in the trees for like the last half hour so nice to break out and get to see some shit it's definitely not gonna seem that steep but this is a pretty gnarly shit to go down. This sweet little canyon I'm dropping down into. There's a bridge down there. We gotta cross. <sighs> Whew! It's definitely steep here though. And loose. <sighs> yeah, that's a far fall. Oh, this will be fun. Yeah, that's what I just came down. Pretty rad. Well, there has, has not been a whole lot of this today, but I finally got some really, really flat wide trail going in front of me here and really open up and pick up the pace. This is sweet. That's what I got out in front of me.
story of the weekend, helicopter buzzing over top. But I think that's just par for the course when you're hiking in the Klein River. Right along the David Thompson, so you get those David Thompson helicopter tours flying over here all the time, but now this is a this is a super cool stretch of trail here though. This is awesome. Hi lady. Hi. Like my backpacking ensemble. I like it. Well, almost finished up here. We got, I don't know, a couple hundred meters left here, and then, uh, well, two of us are almost done. Uh, Buddy and I are actually gonna head back on the trail as soon as we get to the car and uh, grab Simon and Isaac's packs for them to lighten up their loads. They're uh, dealing with a little bit of injuries, so it's been a pretty slow trek out, but hey, whatever. You can't plan for that stuff, you just gotta adapt and deal with it. So we kind of figured we're both feeling good, feeling pretty fresh, rip up ahead, dump our packs, head back and help them out. So that's what we're gonna do. But uh, yeah, as always, if you guys have stuck around and watched till here, thank you very much. It was, it was fun, gorgeous area. Definitely gonna come back. See you guys on the next one.